crazy tennis story. Now picture yourself going to a match and you have four rackets and you would probably think there's absolutely no way that you can pop a string on all these four rackets. Now, that is definitely true if most of these rackets were freshly strung. But one time when I played the German prize money club system, I was playing at a place called Stadtlohn and I was playing for Dortmund back in those days and I'd come to the court with four rackets but unfortunately I was too lazy to get them strung fresh before the match so they were all played with and what ended up happening was that I popped all four rackets in the middle of the third set. Now if you had followed me for a while you know that I'm super picky with rackets and in fact I played with the same exact racket for more than 15 years it was the Wilson Hyperhammer 5.2 so in the third set against a very good opponent this guy was 700 ATP I had no more rackets so my dad was thankfully there watching my match and he had a very similar a racket in the trunk and he got, got and grabbed it for me and I played with it and it was fine but unfortunately at five all I popped that racket as well so now my dad panicked and he went around and asked to borrow a racket from someone now he unfortunately didn't ask uh, a player but he asked a recreational person that was just watching at the club and he borrowed the racket uh, from a rec player and this was a typical recreational player racket a huge head I don't remember the brand it was a thick beam thick profile and it was super light it was close uh, to be unplayable at the high level and I don't know how but somehow even with this horrible racket I ended up winning the match seven six and a third and I never forgot this match because from that day on I always made sure that I have at least one or two freshly strung rackets in the bag because then it's super unlikely that you're going to pop all your strings and have to resort to borrow a racket from somebody else.